Hey, what's up everybody? I'm Don the Duck, and I decided to do a Nuzlocke. Uh, with what began all the Nuzlocke's. The original Pokemon Ruby. Uh, so I figured let's kick this off and let's see how far I can take it. I've actually never been able to complete a Nuzlocke. I've tried multiple times. Either I just ended out of disinterest or everybody dies horribly. Hopefully this time I can actually do it, but let's find out. It's Professor Birch. Hi, sorry to keep you waiting. Welcome to the world of Pokemon. My name is Birch, but everyone calls me the Pokemon Professor. No! No, sir! That is Oak. This is what we call a Pokemon. This world is widely inhabited by creatures known as Pokemon. I don't know why it sounds like this, just go with it. We humans live alongside Pokemon, at times as friendly playmates, and at times as cooperative workmates. And sometimes we band together and battle others like us. But despite our closeness, we don't know everything about Pokemon. In fact, there are many, many secrets surrounding Pokemon. This is probably going to go on for like five, six minutes and then I'm going to like flip it off the voices. I just want to do it for the intro. To unravel Pokemon mysteries, I've been undertaking research. That's what I do. No shit, you're a professor. And you are? Well, sir, I'm the embodiment of death. I'm going to kill everyone that I love in this game and everything else. Oh, before I forget, the rules for my Nuzlocke are going to be pretty simple. Uh, no duplicates. I must catch the first Pokemon that I run into on every route, which is a basic Nuzlocke rule. If they faint, they are dead. If I can use only one item in battle for healing. I've tried doing it with no items and it ends badly every time. I've watched other people try it and it always ends badly. So I want to try just one item. If this works successfully, the next one I do, I will do no items. But one item healing in battle at a time. That's it. So, uh, well, this is going to end horribly. And this is probably going to end badly. But of course, I'm a boy because I'm down the duck. What's my name? Well, it's not Landon, I can tell you that. I am the duck. Yes. Is it duck? You're damn right it is. <laughs> oh, okay. Your duck is moving to my hometown of Little Root. I get it now. Yes, and death, blood, and despair are gonna follow me. Alright, are you ready? Your very own adventure is about to unfold. Take courage and leap into the world of Pokemon, where dreams, adventure, and friendships await. Well, I'll be expecting you later. Come see me in my Pokemon lab. How do they do all this? Is this like some weird dream? I know Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire kind of did it like he was getting a video message, but I've often wondered that. And I've also, never won I've also wondered why. Why am I in the back of the truck in this one? I am always in the back of the truck. My mom hates me, apparently. Just because I took the only room of the house, Mom? Is that where you're mad? Alright, let's get out of here. Doop. Duck, we're here, honey. It must be tiring, riding all our things. Yeah! You stuck me in the back of a truck, Mom. Thank you. And of course, you were already here. You probably drove a car, which means that somebody else drove this truck. Or did you leave me in there until you got comfortable in the house? How do you like it? This is our new home. It's a quaint feel, but it's blah blah blah. Easy place to live, I'm saying. If you guys haven't played Pokemon Ruby, I don't know what to tell you. It's very fun. Like It was one of the games that got me back into Pokemon. And you get your own room, Duck. Let's go. I know. I always get the only room of the house. Come on, now. Every generation. Actually, no. X and Y, I think, broke that. I think my mom had her own room for once. See, Duck, isn't it nice in here, too? The Murder spoke on to all the work. It was moving, cleaning up after. That's so convenient. Your room's upstairs. Go check it out. Dad, while you and clock to mark our move here, don't forget to set it. Oh, yeah, the battery in this is also dead. So, no events. No time clock events. Oh, uh, what time is it? It is... It is... Fuck me! I am Superman! Da -da -da. Whee! 5.20 in the morning right now when I'm playing this. Yeah! How do you like my new room? It's fucking amazing. I have a bed, I have a fucking GameCube, which I'm actually playing this on right now, which is awesome. Everything's put away neatly. They finished moving everything downstairs as well. They're so convenient. You made them into saves. You should make sure everything is all there on your desk. Yeah, sure I will. Uh, da -da. Why? Oh, I'm a rebel. My chair faces the other direction. Oh yeah. Uh, I should have a potion. Yeah. Oh, duck, come here. Alright, what's up, Mom? 
Oh, it's Petaburger Gym. Maybe Dad'll be on. Yeah, maybe. We borrowed this report from the front of Petaburger Gym. Oh, it's over. Fuck me. Thank you, Mom. Thank you. Calling me downstairs so I can look at that. Dad's friend lives in town. Bert's his name. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, okay. Just go sit down, Mom. That's where you sleep, isn't it? You sleep on a fucking table. I love Pokemon. <laughs> They're so fun. Like, I still play them to this day. I'm excited about the two new ones that have just been announced and we're gonna get released. It dates us a bit, but I don't care. Oh, I'm Duck. Yep, I'm Duck. We have a daughter about the same age as you. Our daughter was a general thing in French. Sarah's a thing. Yeah, I bet she is. You're just gonna let me go into your daughter's room online. She has the only room of the house. Pokemon probably restored. Items ready. Ah! Who am I? I'm a guy who broke into your house or your mom let me come upstairs. I mean, I think you should just deal with this fact. Oh, you're Duck. Your move was today. I'm May. Glad to meet you. I just dream of becoming friends with Pokemon all over the world. I bet you do. I bet you want to become friends with the fucking monster that's gonna try to destroy the world, don't you? <laughs> oh no, I forgot. I was supposed to help Dad catch my Pokemon. I'll catch you later, Duck. Alright, May. Bye. Have fun. Uh, can I get my Pokemon now? Yeah. I heard someone shouting on the road down there. What should I do? What should we do? Someone's gotta help. Stand there, dude. Stand at the very edge of the town. We'll just stay here. <laughs> Let's just not help anybody at all. Like, that sounds perfect. Help me. And he's being chased by a Poochiana. Because, yeah, why not? Hey, you over there. Please help. In my back. There's a Pokeball. Alright. Well. Who am I gonna pick? Oh, hell. My favorite is just right now. Uh, now, this generation is Trico. He's, he's the shit, but... Who should I pick? Uh... I'm just close my eyes and do this shit with the controller. I know we can't really tell, but... Cool, I got a Torchic. Alright, that works. Torchic's fun. He has Blaziken. I can kick people in the face with him. Yeah, I beat him with Mudkip. I'm not the biggest fan of Mudkips, they're alright, but eh. There's a hair on my microphone. What does Torchic do? Torchic can kick its fucking head in. Scratch it. Torchic has no arms. I feel sad for Torchic. Scratch it again, Torchic. Eh, our first death. That's just a long line of blood that will flow from your claws, Torchic. I haven't got a chance to name you yet, don't worry. You will get a name. Whew. I wasn't tall grass sitting while Pokemon when I was jumped. You saved me. Thanks a lot. Oh. Hi, you're Duck. This is not a place to chat, so come by my later. My lab later, alright? Sure, why not? So, Duck, I've heard so much about you from your father. I've heard that you don't have your own Pokemon yet. But the way about it earlier, you pulled it off with applaud. I guess you have your father's blood in your veins. I would hope so, unless my mom cheated on my dad with something else. Come on, dude. Oh, thanks for asking me. I like to have a Pokemon you used earlier. Duck received the torch check. Hell yeah, I did. While you're at it, why not give a nickname? I have to. All Pokemon have to have nicknames. I will call you... Uh... I'll call you Hot Rod. I don't know why. Seems like a good name for a Torchic, right? Hot Rod. And it's a boy, so... Alright. If you work at the Pokemon again experience, you'll make a darn good trainer. <laughs> That's like the closest I've ever seen a game come to Cursing that's fucking that's family oriented. Oh, my kids are around 13. Might have a bad idea if you can say, Yeah, sure, why not? I'll go see your daughter. Teach me what it means to be a trainer. Yeah, because that's something I don't already know. You go home. Alright, let's go, Hot Rod. Our adventure begins. Let's go kill Mace, friends. Oh, my running shoes already, damn it. This one, Pokemon. Nope. Since Generation 1, they broke that out. Hello, Wormpuff. By the way, none of this counts, if you don't already know that. I'm kind of running into things that I can't do anything about. So, yeah. Wormpuff, he's a string shot. Hot Rod speed, though. How dare you make my Hot Rod slower? He's the Hot Rod. His whole thing is speed. Ah, stop that, you fucking worm. Now, scratch your face up again. The blood drip from your orifices. Orifice I? Orifices is. I don't know. I'm an old elf hound. Hello, stranger. I know if I talk to you, you'll give me a potion. <laughs> I'm gonna edit this part out. 
Oh, that was all it took. Never mind. Thought I had to, like, do it. No, that's in gold and silver. Yeah, that was totally worth it. There's a noise when I walk into ledges. <laughs> I never noticed that. Ah, no, we'll just fight me. Pokemon found on Route 113, though. Hi, Duck. Oh, I see my dad gave you a Pokemon. Since we're here, let's have a quick battle. I get a taste of what being a trainer is like. I'm gonna kick your ass, man. I don't even think you can win. Okay? This shit is a beatdown, alright? I'm here to beat you down. You and your mudkip with it. Face that looks like it's seen the eyes of death. Mukdips looked into the eyes of death and death looked away. Scratch it. Oh god. Oh god. This isn't gonna well. Oh, there we go. Crit it up, hot rod. I'm about to say, I swear to god, if it's a crit for crit, I'm gonna be mad. Yeah! Your mudkip has fallen to the might of Hot Rod. Hot Rod got 69 experience points. Hell yeah. Oh, so close to two levels. Hot Rod is almost going to learn his first good attack. Wow, you're pretty good. You're damn right I am. Now give me your money. Just beat up a girl for a Pokemon and take her money. My dad has an eye out for you now. It means he's just got a Pokemon that he likes you. He's a friend that got Pokemon easily. It's time to head back to the lab. Alright. Bye, May. I'm gonna beat more innocent creatures into the ground. Shut up. Tell me what I can do. Let's hurry home. Yeah, sure, man. It's, it's a fucking straight walk. I'm gonna beat one more creature into the floor. That way I can level up one more time. I'm gonna be level 7. Oh, one more rule I forgot. If I do knock out a Pokemon, the first Pokemon I encounter, I don't get to catch anything else on that route. So this will be fun. Hot Rod. Yeah! Hot Rod is getting more powerful. He learned focus and- oh god damn it! I forgot I don't learn Ember until later. Everybody else learns like an attack at level 7. He learns em He learns focus energy. Cause that's what I want you to do. I want you to focus your energy. Don't use your natural attribute at all. Fucking Hot Rod. I already hate you. I want you to die first. I'm gonna sacrifice you to the first rock I come across. I heard you beat May on your first try. It needs to help my research a long time. She's helped me research a long time. She only has a level 5 Pokemon. I'm a little worried about your daughter. I ordered this for my research, so I think she should have this Pokedex. Yeah. Uh, it's a high tech tool that I'm going to make a record of any Pokemon you need to catch. My kid May goes everywhere. Whenever my kid catches a rare Pokemon and records his dad in the Pokedex, why May looks for me when I'm out. I'm doing field work and shows me. Wow, Doc, you got a Pokedex, too. That's great. Just like me. I've got something for you, too. Fuck yeah, and I can start go catching shit. Doc, put the Pokeballs away. Blah, blah, blah. Yes! Yes, I know. Can we just begin the death? You gonna give me stuff? Nope. Alright. <laughs> Bye, Mom. I'm leaving. I'm telling you I'm leaving. You have a room now. Why are you mad about it? Yep. Yep. There we go. There's my running shoes. I can sprint. Where am I going to run extra fast? If you're on Pokemon now, you'll probably be able to enjoy. Please be careful. Come home. Blah. Ah, not the Pokedex. I don't give a damn about the Pokedex. Uh, let's see a hot run real first. Mom! Mom! Heal my Pokemon! Thank you, Mom. That's all you're really good for in the end. Take care, honey. Alright, yep. Oh, I can't run in the house. What kind of bullshit is that? Ha! The adventure begins. My torment through death and defense. Let's get our first Pokemon. Alright, who are we gonna get? Who are we gonna get? Please don't be a wormhole. Son of a bitch! Oh, I'm gonna kill it, aren't I? Alright. Scratch it and don't kill it, Hot Rod. Alright. I'm terrified of killing it already. Ah! Throw a Pokeball at it. Grunt, Loki, be good. Come on. Hide your Where's your Got him. Cheap, alright. Oh, I forgot this doesn't click. Yeah, we got our first new friend. 
No, oh, friend, slave, meat shield, I don't know, whatever you want to call him. Oracle's data was added. Uses the spikes on its rear end, Oracle peels on barks and feeds him a sap that oozes out. There's Pokemon to tip the suction pads, I'll have to cling to glass without slipping. That's pretty cool. Yep. Uh... I'm gonna call you... Edo. Bindo. Bindo the Wormbo. Alright. Uh... Hmm. I don't want to make this first episode too long, but I want to actually get stuff done. So, let's go see my dad. These episodes are going to get a lot more edited as they go on, which I'm not really that upset about. A lot of those will be me editing, you know, while I'm grinding and stuff like that, because I don't think anybody want to watch, wants to watch grinding. Alright, guys. Hot Ride, switch out with Bindo. Actually, let's head back this way. Let's level up Bindo a little bit. So, uh, I'm gonna... Alright, guys. Uh, I'm back. Just did a little bit of grinding. I got Bindo up to level 5 now. So, let's venture on. Route 102. Actually, hold on. This is Route 101. What is this? Route 103. Alright. Save you for emergency Pokemon. <laughs> Alright. Oh, my first battle. Alright. Oh, he's excited. You got Pokemon with you, and you're an official Pokemon trainer. Yep. Can't say no to my challenge. I didn't plan on it. I plan on beating the crap out of you, taking your money, and laughing at you, child. The Zigzagoon, level 5. Let's get you the hell out of there, Bindo. You're gonna get the shit kicked out of you if you fight this thing. Hot Rod. Yeah, growl it up. Growl it up, buddy. I got something for you. I will focus my energy, because why not? Yeah, Hot Rod's getting pumped. He's going to bump you up. I don't know why. Now, scratch it. Yeah. Stop growling me, you prick. Oh, Jesus, that was a lot more damage than I wanted it to be. Alright, I need to kill this thing now. We need to kill it now. Kill it, Hot Rod! <laughs> no, no, Hot Rod, no. You no die, Hot Rod. There we go. Hot Rod's level 8 now. That's right, Calvin. Kicked your ass, Calvin. You and your zigzagoon. Oh, yeah, I forgot I can't heal him like that in this one. <laughs> I got very used to that in the old one. Alright. Uh, yeah, let's get a second Pokemon. Come on, Lotad. I think it's Lotad or C Dot in this one. Ha! I can't get another one of you, so I don't care. Fuck off. Wormful, tackle it to death. Or don't. I mean, that's perfectly fine too. Wormful! Or Bindo, I mean. You let a wild one kick the shit out of you. Seriously, dude, you're getting beat up by a weaker one. How do you miss two tackles in a row? It's got like a percentage of 95%. Ooh, yeah. Alright, it's got some Pokemon here, man. Come on. Oh yeah, Poochiana, I like that. Level 4, alright. Uh, Bindo, you'll die. Let's get you out of there. Poochiana tackles. Alright, that wasn't that bad. I was worried. I was like, oh man, don't be- Whoa! Calm down there, Hot Rod. Alright, we want to catch him, not destroy his essence. And this ain't Undertale, alright? Oh, come on, Poochiana. Get in the Pokeball, you little prick. You little motherfucker! I don't have that many Pokeballs. I have three now. And I can't hit you again, because I'll probably kill you. Stay in the Pokeball. 
There we go. Got him. Luciano's caught him. Give me an anxiety attack over here. At first sight, Bucciano take a bite seven minute moves. This Pokemon chase it after prey until the victim becomes exhausted. However, it turns tail before he strikes back. Of course. Since Bucciano's like a dog, I'm gonna name him after my dog in real life. My Loki. My German Shepherd. Let's go heal. <laughs> uh... Not going on. I can't walk into a door, apparently. Maybe that's why all the new Pokemon have double doors. Would explain a lot. Alright, guys, we're three deep. We are three deep in this party now. What? Alright. Let's get to the next town and see our dad, and then we'll end the episode there, I think. Uh, no, I'll, I'll train him later. You're a bug trainer. I ain't scared of you. You got the goofy hat on. Buck trainers always wear goofy hats. That's just the way it goes. The other children nobody plays with. His name is Rick. He has a wormhole. I have a hot rod. Feel my wrath. Feel the wrath of hot rod. That hot rod's coming to penetrate. Never mind. That just got worse. You ain't got nothing on this, son. Uh, scratch him up again, Hot Rod. Yeah! All that experience. Just let me eat it up. Oh yeah, I forgot I don't have a switch system set up. Whatever's out there is out there. Makes it just a bit more annoying. Because it's like, ah, he's sending out a Gyarados to fight Hot Rod. What the hell do I do? I gotta waste turns to trade that. Which is cool. It uh, makes it a bit more strategy oriented, but... There we go. But catch you rich, got his ass kicked. You need your sixty-four dollars. How are you a child and have sixty-four dollars? That's more than I had as a fucking adult. That's more than I had ever as a child. What have we got here? A zigzagoon. I think Bindo can kill it. Oh, Bindo knows poison signal. I forgot. Why am I not using the better of the two attacks? Oh, keep tackling it. Let's not poison it at all. I'm a dingus. Wow! Better the two attacks, Undone. Good job, Duck. He's growling, yeah, yeah, but still, come on. Let's have Hot Rod out. Hot Rod's gonna be a crutch for a little while. Until I can, you know, trust everyone else not to die when I throw them out there against things. Yeah, scratch it up, Hot Rod. What is with Zigzagoons and growling, man? It's like the only thing they know how to do. Stop growling at me! Alright, just let me kill you. There. Is that so difficult? Uh... Yeah, let's beat up this last child. He'll get me up to... He'll get, uh... Badoom up to six. I almost damned him Bidoof, but I was like, I can't do that. Alan sent out his Poochiana. Bindo, come back. Oh, you missed a tackle like a punk. Scratch him. Scratch him up good. Well, it raises your attack, I ain't worried about that. As long as you don't know Roar. Roar would be terrifying. That's not terrifying. I ain't a little. Bindo! Okay, level six. Oh yeah, plus two more attack. That's what we need. Hot Rod. You gonna learn Ember now? No. <sighs> Hello. Scratch the shit out of it. Scratch that goddamn bird. Grab all you want. I will scratch your face in. I need one of those. Booyah. I called you here because I thought I could beat you. Give me your money. For really, these kids have 60, 48, 50 berries. Foreign berries. Yep, I'll take those. Because Bidoom's gonna need one, and so will Loki. Whee! Oh, it's the last battle, alright. 
Uh, you're up to that, so let's put Loki in for a little bit. Let him get some boosts. I'm gonna keep winning and aim to be the best trainer. Help me further my career. I wish this was my career. Just play Pokemon, that'd be awesome. Last wants to battle. Go ahead, Loki. Show her what you're made of. Now get back here and hide. Good job, Loki. Way to go. My Loki's just sleeping in a sleeping right now because he's so involved with what I do. <laughs> I apologize. When I said Loki, he stood up, looked at me, and then fell back over. He's so involved. I guess when you're five years old, you don't care anymore. Let's go, Hot Rod. Let's finish this off. Yeah! What we got next? Come on, I'll kick everything you got. I gotta go see my dad. See my pops. Challenge him to a fight. Booyah. Growl all you want. Okay, it ain't gonna make a difference. I'm gonna just... Ah, scratch him like a cat fight. Oh, and I critted him. I critted him. <laughs> Gained 51 experience points. Hell yeah. I think a level 10 I learned with my first fire attack. End up furthering my career. You're damn right you did. Okay, you're looking at the future Pokemon champion. Or someone who lost everyone he loves. I'm not sure yet. Alright, we made it to Pedalburg City. Let's heal up real quick, and then we'll see our pops. Yep, yep, yep. Nurse Joy, I don't, I don't want to talk to you. Just heal them. Wow, that guy is weird looking. Thank you. I got always one door in, but two doors out. Alright, you guys. Uh, I think we'll end the first episode here. So far, you know, pretty productive. Nobody's dead. Which is always a plus in a Nuzlocke. But, uh, yep. I think we'll finish it here, and we'll pick the next one up with us meeting our dad, and I think we help another guy, too. I haven't played this one in a long time, so I'm not 100%. But, thanks for watching, you guys. If you like what you see, cool. You know, if you have any other games or ideas you'd like me to play, let me know in the comments down below. And as always, though, have a good one.